What is up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Hooking with Hutch. Where we're with Zach. We got the John boat. We're at Charcoal. Same ordeal. If you guys watch the videos, you already know what it is. I bought this frozen Elsa rod, as you're going to see in the mm. clip prior to this. Got it paired with a nice little green pumpkin jig with a green pumpkin rage craw. And hopefully, we're not going to snap off. Goal is to catch one fish on it. After that, me and Zach are going to free fish. Hopefully, get on some mondos. We're going to rush right out there. We'll see you guys on the water. This is a big man's pole is what this is. What a cast. I'm terrified right now. I'm gonna like get the cast down with this thing. There we go, that's a little bit better. I had a girl Elsa. Go out? What's that song? Let it snow. Please don't snow. I don't, I don't want it to be ice fishing season. I don't want to have to scrap money together and find a way to get to Texas for the winter. I mean, I do want to find a way, but... Oh, what a cast, Elsie. That's what I'm talking about. Man, something might rip this rod out of my hands, to be honest. I got it now. Oh. You got something? Yeah, you got something. Oh. <laughs> that looked like a fish you, the way your rod was bending. That's what I, I was like, oh, I, got <laughs> I thought for sure you were on. I was like, dang, Zach, wait to just. Bag on me. <laughs> there it is. It was only a matter of time before Zach bursted out in the song. That also rod's right hand reel, too. That ain't the hand I reel with. <laughs> oh, she, she freaking goes, eh? <laughs> I hope. I hope. <laughs> this thing can cast. Holy cow. I think I got the casting down finally. <laughs> my main, my new main rod, guys. The Shakespeare Frozen 4 Plus Kitty Rod. I Man, I can't remember the last time I picked one of these up. Like... I remember using one when I was a kid, but God, I don't remember how young I was. I don't think I used one very long. You just cast behind yourself, Zachy. <laughs> oh, yeah, right in those freaking weeds right there. This thing's got to have like a 7 freaking .31 gear ratio, man. This thing hauls. All right, we got a Guggen blooper on with the uh, old frozen rod now. Wow, it actually casts well. That way, if it snaps us off, we at least see the fish, hopefully. I think this is the right location to toss this, though. Maybe we'll get it to pop well. Come on, just let me get this out of the way. Just one fish. I'm making serious fish. <laughs> It is the Elsa pole problems. Come on, Elsa. I need you to work here. We gotta get a fish in the boat. Oh, there's some. There we go. We got one. <laughs> yes. It's a little tiny piker pickle. Come on, Betsy. Get in here, Elsa. Oh, a little chain pickerel. There we go. Oh, we actually got one on the Elsa. There. There we go, guys. Just a little chain pickerel on the Elsa rod. See you, buddy. Thanks for biting. Yeah. Now I can fish for real. <laughs> this thing's all knotted up. Jesus. All right, Elsa. Something. Seems decent from here. There we go. Yeah, sure is. Oh, it's a bass? 
Really? I thought we had a pike for sure. A boat flip the old girl. There we go. We got a bass in the boat. Can you imagine that on the Elsa rod? <laughs> Man, I thought for sure that was a pike. Yeah, it looked long and skinny. That's why I was confused. I was like, oh, sweet. We got what we want. blotchy bass see that spot right on the mouth there yep. yeah it's actually like a skin disease oh. that's a pretty fish though not a bad one at all thanks for biting buddy you want to let go of my glove see it sweet dude yeah buddy. Boom. let's get you on one eh Yep, this one's probably a pick roll it looks like. Either a pike or a pickle. Pickle. Pretty little pickle. See you. He took off of that weed in his mouth still. <laughs> Oh, yep, there it is, finally. Oh, let go. Huh? It let go. Uh, fish? Yeah. Mm. Not sure if it was like on TV or not. No, I watched it blow up on it. Well, that sucks. It's so hard to get line to the fish. No, I think I got it. It's like I don't feel any tension. The fish is running with it and there's no tension, so can't even set the hook. Alright, Elsa. One last chance, one last chance to finish it off. You better freaking do something.